we are now going to look at the relationship between repeated linear factors and the appearance of the graph at the related roots. And so I am going to make a repeated linear factor at negative 2. And rather than type x plus 2 times x plus 2, I'm actually going to do x plus 2 squared. And I'm going to multiply, going to multiply that by x minus 1. And I can see I have generated a cubic equation. It will be degree 3. I have two unique linear factors, x plus 2 and x minus 1. The x plus 2 is squared. Now, when I look at the x-intercept here, negative 2, if I zoom in at that x-intercept, I can see basically this looks kind of like a parabola at negative 2, which is related to this x plus 2 squared. Now, let's go take a look at the other related root, or the other x-intercept related to this x minus 1. Over here, if I zoom in, essentially, this looks linear to me. The second thing we are going to be examining is the relationship between the appearance of the roots, whether they look like a quadratic or a linear function, or potentially, if they look like a cubic function, and the powers or the exponents on the repeated roots.